Hi, I'm Scott Anderson, and I'm a part of Scott Anderson Design. So if you found us, you're probably checking to see and learn about us and our designers and learn about our company. I'm just one part of it, but let me tell you a little bit about myself. Since I've been a little kid, I have always remembered being outside in nature, whether it was playing in our yard with our massive old azalea bush that we had, or climbing in the large blue spruce we had in our side yard, or creating a fort in our giant oak tree in our backyard. I've always been outside, exploring and playing. I remember being a kid and going away to Vermont and getting lost in the woods for hours, exploring the woods, the streams, finding waterfalls, interesting paths, just roaming, looking at nature and seeing what's there until I find my way back to where I started and where we were staying. So when I got a bit older, I knew I wanted to end up in the architectural field. So I started looking for a school that had a program for architecture. I didn't even know there was a category at that point for landscape architecture. So it wasn't until my second year in college that I even knew there was a thing. But thankfully I had a professor that helped me and pushed me in that direction and he was in the landscape architectural field. I knew I wanted to be creative and work with my hands. I always loved building things and designing things, so getting in the world of architecture and landscape architecture was just a natural fit. So I got my five-year degree with a minor in landscape architecture from New York Institute of Technology, and then I went on to Farmingdale College. That's where I finished schooling, and I learned, and I got my degree for horticultural. That's where I took the classes in the horticultural department to learn the stuff that I didn't already know about particular plants. I was lucky enough to stumble into a great job with one of Long Island's leading architectural firms at such a young age. And then eventually they helped push me to work for one of Long Island's premier landscape architectural firms, Michelle and Associates. Because of that, I was able to work and see most of Long Island's oldest estates on the Gold Coast of Long Island. It was here I learned and honed my skill in creating amazing outdoor spaces. In the late 90s, after working for my professor for many years, I decided to go out on my own and start Scott Anderson Design. This is where I learned I had a passion for English gardens and creating beautiful spaces, whether it was a large backyard or a very simple front yard. I loved the idea of English gardens because they'd be overflowing with color and would have flowers and color four seasons out of the year. Somewhere along the way, I realized I had a love for water. I guess I always knew I had a love for water since I was a kid. I remember when I was a young kid hanging out at the beach, surfing, swimming, till I became pruned as anything. I would spend every day possible in my teens and 20s on a beach and in the ocean and so years later it was just natural for me to realize I wanted to find a way to introduce water into every one of our landscape projects. I realized water was a calming element that could tie a space together. So today we look at every home we work on and we look at ways to add a water feature in every project so our clients can truly enjoy the space day and night, 365 days a year. So I'm happy to help you and see what I can come up with for you. If you're ever looking to find me, it's probably a good chance I'm outside somewhere, maybe building something or swimming or off with my kids on a bike ride or getting ready for a new adventure with my family. I'm Scott Anderson, and I'm only a small part of Scott Anderson Design, but why not reach out to us to give us a shot? You'll be pleasantly surprised.